You know when you're trying to spy on your neighbors across the street out in the yard because it looks like they're doing something interesting, but you can't actually see what they're doing? That's what's happening right now. That's my life today, I suppose. And in the meantime, let's just chat for a moment about today because didn't quite go how I planned. That's okay. But I stayed up late enough last night that I told myself I was not going to set an alarm. But if I did wake up on time, I was going to go to church. And then I woke up like 45 minutes into church and was like, yep, nope, that's not going to happen. <laughs> and then went to brunch with my sister instead, which was very fun and much needed in terms of people time. But I mean, ultimately, still didn't quite do what I wanted to slash needed to do, so it could have been better. But then we went to see Solo, at least finally seen it now, and it was fun to watch it in a theater full of families. I wouldn't have wanted to do that the first time. But it was fun to hear the kids commentary on it a little bit it was it was cute and yeah just continuing to lay low because whatever this sickness was really kicked my butt <laughs> and I'm still just absolutely exhausted and I'd really like that to not be a thing anymore and I don't know how long it's going to last, but got to do what you got to do, I guess. Going to go back to Monk, which is, side note, still one of my favorite shows. And watching through it this time around, I'm paying a lot more attention to it. And it's just so well written and well acted. And I love that. I love that a show can be around that long, and even the first season is solid. A lot of shows can't say that. But you know, every once in a while you hit a gem, and that is Monk. And now I'm going to go back to that gem. <laughs>